This story has gone absolutely crazy. I don't even know where to start with this Miami Aliens thing, right? Okay, so. Out of the blue, I'm seeing all this alien stuff in Miami. So the other day I did, uh, was it yesterday? I think yesterday, or the day before, I did a video about Miami, right? These aliens um, seen in Miami with footage. Well, this video you're going to see today is... Basically what I found out so far and there's new information weird information stuff which just just blows your, your like your your mind okay so it seems like oh hang on does it seem like I fuck it, I like I don't know if there's aliens or not all right but I'm just going to say the footage that I showed you the other day of what looked like an alien now seems to be clearly it was like two or three officers walking together. But because the the footage was so blurry, it just looked like some sort of manifest manifestation of some sort, okay? However, I'm going to show you some videos today of different things which correlate with the story, but then some don't. And, right, it's crazy. It's absolutely crazy. But listen, before we get into these videos, I need to tell you that... Tonight at seven o'clock UK time, baby. I'm gonna uh, I'm gonna upload my very own top five paranormal video. Okay, it's not gonna have my face on it or anything, so please look out for it. Seven o'clock. Look on my channel because I'm gonna be open. Uh, I'll, I'll put this is the screenshot. This is the thumbnail. So look out for this thumbnail. Okay, it's gonna be my very first top five. I'm super excited about it. I really hope you like it. But anyway, right? Okay. So, there's these people, there's these witnesses that are coming out now saying, like, they've seen X, Y, and Z. I'm going to show you, show you some witness accounts, and I'm going to talk you through what I think, all right? But then, there's this new footage that not a lot of people are talking about that could be CGI, but it could be aliens, and it, it, sort, of, it sort of correlates to the stories of what people are saying, and it's really weird, so I want to show you. But first of all, remember this guy? You've probably seen him. If you're into this story, you've probably seen him, okay? Right, this guy here. Where's my bloody cursor? Right, hang on. Right, this guy. Um, Sosa pa Pippin. Uh, Pippin. Sosa Pippin. Right, listen. Nobody's going to talk about it. Oh, hang on. I figured, yeah, you know, right. fuck it. Like, you know what I'm saying? I was uh, I was down in Miami for uh, the New Year's. You know what I'm saying? Me and my girl. I got a little timeshare. We was down there on a... um. Like a mini vacay, you know, mm -hmm. just to start the New Year's off right. So anyway, we had we happened to be at that mall. So um, we had Foot Locker or whatever. Next thing you know, you start hearing all this commotion outside. Sound like fire, like firecrackers or something. So you know what I'm saying? I you know I grab her close. I'm like, yo, we about to get up out of here because I you know I originally thought that they were shooting. You know what I'm saying? I thought you right. know. Pay close attention to the details of what he says, because. I'm going to throw a couple of curveballs in this video, right? Pay attention to the detail of what he says. Some type of um, gunfight had broke out, whatever the case is, because, you know, we're not familiar with Miami. We're not familiar with the city. So I'm like, damn, I ain't even got my blick. So, you know what I'm saying? We about to, we about to, <laughs> we about to swerve. Next thing I know, it's like crazy. Like, we just see all these people running, like, you know, uh, fat, fat, fat chicks. You know, old ladies like I'm talking about moving. You know it saying? must be serious. Some some fat chicks are fucking running. <laughs> the way he just throws out. Sorry, I carry on. Like yo, old people even move. I'm talking about moving. So you know, my girl, she like, what's going on? I'm like, fuck all that. We out. Like I'm not gonna ask no questions. We just gonna follow the crowd. Next thing you know, you know, real like gunshots start going off. So you know what I'm saying? Like we trying to we trying to follow the follow the crowd. Get out of there. I look back. I look back, no cap, yo, no cap. I look back, it looked like, like, like a big ass shadow, but it was solid at the same time, like a few, like a few shadows, but they were solid at the same time. And them, it's, it almost looked like they was coming our direction, like they was chasing us, but they was disappearing and reappearing closer. So I'm like, yo, what? So we start really moving. Next thing you know, we start hearing more gunshots, like these dudes start firing at this shit get outside mad police all that you know what i'm saying they start the police is like trying to get all the people that ran out the mall they like trying to like 
um, detain these people, or whatever. But you know, me and my girl, we ended up just you know s s sliding past all that and everything like that. But you know, a lot of people saying why didn't nobody film and all that when that type of shit is going on. You know what I'm saying shit like that, like some paranormal. Nobody thinking about no phones. You do, you, do you think though? Do you think that? Do you honestly think out of all of those hundreds of people that are running out from the mall, not one of them who thought that they were in a reasonably safe distance, even like from afar, would have gone, mate, this shit's going to go viral, right? And gets out their mobile phone and starts recording. Not one of them. You know, I don't know. I don't know about that. You know what I'm saying? Everybody going survival mode. But for real, for real, they lying, yo. It was they all them all them officers and all that. They was not there because of um, no kids fighting. It was really some. It was really some like movie shit going on in there, yo. So, you know, that's what it was, yo. Right. Okay. So that clip went absolutely viral. Everyone was talking about it. Okay. But then a day or two later, this is what he said. How I wake up. My shit jumping like the trap. Nah, but for real. Like, like, real shit though on the dead homies. I was trolling. I ain't never even, um, I ain't never even been to Miami. <laughs> shit, yo, y'all be bugging. Yo, real shit though. Y'all stay away from them fucking aliens and all that. Y'all be, y'all be safe out there. Yo. Right? So, a couple of days, he just says, yeah, fuck it. I was, I was joking. I, I was lying. So, some people are saying... Oh, he was paid to lie. They told him to, to, to say that he was lying. You know, they, they paid him to do that video because they want to cover it up. Could be, may not be. What do you think? But hang on a second. Okay, hang on a second. So there's this other guy that I'm going to show you now. And his story, like I said, sort of correlates to what... I mean, right. Hold up for this guy because... <laughs> This guy's had a few cigarettes of the herbal kind, okay? And we went, you know, we went to the mall just, you know, to see what's up. So this, this is what happened. This, this is, this is what happened. This is where I, I, I'll draw you what can happen. This is what happened, okay? There's a whole bunch of, there's a whole bunch of, you know, teens, right? You know, a whole bunch of, a whole bunch of teens, a whole bunch of teens. And they had this little, they had this little fucking box, tapes. like a little DVD player type thing, right? And they were like, yeah, watch, watch, go ahead. And there was a whole bunch of them. They look all nerdy. They weren't like thugged out. They were, I mean, they all dressed nice and shit or whatever, but you know, they were just right there, combo and shit. And a lot of them had like backpacks and some of them had like weird guys glasses, like, like, like welding glasses. And I was like, what the fuck? And the other guy was like, just go ahead and plug it in. I mean, we're right here. We're safe, you know? And, and, and so somebody plugged this shit in and it started, it started flickering, it started flickering, right? Cause there was a column right here. You know, I was over here on the top. I was up here on the top of the so, left. So, so he was at the top overlooking and listening and watching kids with backpacks and saying, you know, having a bit of a scuffle or whatever, notice what they were wearing, all this sort of detail. Like, wh why is he looking? If nothing's kicked off yet, why is he looking? So that just made me think, mm, hang on a second. But 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 wait, because some of the, the things that he says here correlate to matey. Um, what's his name? Pippin or whatever. It is so, so, so Pippin. They were down here and I was watching them from over here. Okay. So this shit started flickering and it was flicking the rolls of lights right here. All these lights were flickering. Then it started popping. When it started popping, everybody from over here started running this way to see because everybody was nosy. And as soon as it started popping, this thing started glowing and it started going like, like a, like a force field. Woo, 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 woo. And everybody that was behind this that I was seeing, everybody looked like this, like, like digital. Like, it was being disruptive, by the way. See, th th this is weird shit. And now a lot, I know a lot of people have got good imaginations. But the way he's talking about this, it's so detailed. And it's so, like, you can see he's almost frustrated with how he's trying to get out what he's seen. Like, you know? I, I don't know. I don't know. But listen. Wait. Only right here. 
Not right here. Everything else was still flickering. Right here was still popping. People were running. As soon as they got close and they see how this thing was moving, everybody started going this way. When they started going this way, these guys started backing up because from this, it started glowing and it looked like somebody put a foot out like that. And then somebody put a hand out like that. And then all you see was this. All you see was like this, an image like that. That's all I seen. This was all glowing, so it was bright. But do you notice how he, he how, I know it's only a, a sketch, but he's drawing the kids, right? Like an inch tall. But then he's drawing a foot. That's just a foot and a, I suppose a, le a leg, right? Excuse me, sorry. <laughs> And that's two inch already, just a leg and a foot. So also, like straight away, he's drawing these things bigger. And he's not even talking about that, but subconsciously, he's drawing these things bigger. This was the only the dark thing that I thought I seen come out. It looked like that. That's what came out. I was right here looking. It was me and four other dudes. Two other guys ran over here and started filming. I'm waiting for them to give me the footage. Yeah, but where's the footage, mate? They say they got this thing coming out and it looked, it didn't look like somebody. It looked more like the end, everything got disrupted and was all wavy and it, and it did that effect. That's what it looked like to me. You know, I, I'm, this now, this coming forward is the, is like similar information of what so, so Pippin said. Okay. Th this next bit. I'm in, you know, I, I'm like, I, I'm a graffiti artist. You know, I can do all kinds of shit with a spray paint can. I can see. <laughs> and it makes it look like, you know, whatever, whatever. But, you know, when you get a mirror and bend it and all kind of crazy shit or, you know, the sounds and whatever shit they got going on. But Th this is this is another point I wanted to make as well. He's talking about like he's a graffiti artist. Obviously, he's sketching and, and sketching when you're trying to like when you're trying to draw or paint something which you don't really see every day. If you, saw, if you wanted to paint a car or a house or a face or something like that, you can. But he says, when you start manipulating mirrors and sounds and stuff, it's hard to actually put down on paper because you've got to see it to believe it, right? This is why he's struggling. So which, which makes me feel like, is he, is he talking legit, you know? But this next bit here is where he, it correlates to um, Pippin. Yeah, man, I, I, I seen, I seen this. This is what I seen. And it looked like it was coming out of this. And, and it's because whatever little box they had was bright and, and, and almost like a, like, you know, one of those military flashlights that they were trying to plug up, but it had like a horn to it. Cause it was like, Arr! and all this was like. Now, him saying horn, I, I did see another video. Somebody else saying that these things were making some sounds or they heard sounds of like a siren, like a horn or something like that. Disrupting and, and, and this shit right here was popping, you know, all this right here was popping. But this is what I seen. This is what I seen come out. This is what I saw. And everybody's like, and everybody's taking off, screaming like, oh my God, look at that. Everybody's turned around and look back to see this. And they were like, oh my God, oh my God, and running. And, and at that point, all the, this shit already fell and broke. And we were still right here walking this way because somebody started shooting from over here. Cause we see. This is what sounds like Pippin's story. Something like later on, somebody started shooting, right? In lights. Like two or three lights, and then the dudes that are right here, because those people right here looking, they took off this way. That's what I see. Uh, like, in some ways, it's probably a little bit too much information and detail they set. Like, he's up there watching, okay? I suppose from, from afar, you could probably feel quite comfortable sitting there and like, what the hell is going on? But I think that if something that you saw was so out of this world, I don't think, apart from the shooting going on, I don't think that you would necessarily 
be paying much attention to these group of people running that way and these group of people running this way and two guys behind you came along and, and ran, you'd be like, what the fuck am I seeing right now? You'd be like, what? What the hell am I seeing? And bang, 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 bang. Oh my God, they're shooting. What? And then you go back to this like blurry fucking thing. Portals coming out. Right? You know what I mean? So I don't know. It's, it, it, it's very weird. But it did, it did sort of correlate to Pippin's story. It's still questioned. Like the question is, why did it take, apparently it was it 60 police cars and 100 officers? Like, why did it take that many when they say it was a group of kids of sticks? <laughs> right? I'm sure if you went on YouTube now and you YouTubed police capture kids with sticks, it wouldn't be 60 police cars. It would be one police officer, maybe two, three max, taking on a kid or two, right? You know, anyway, so that's the question. There's another witness who also says the same sort of stuff as the, <coughs> the other one. Look, but they don't repeat it in exactly the same way, but in some way they do. Listen to this one. I'm in my basement and film this. This shit is so crazy. I'm posting this, uh, and I want y'all to repost, save this video, post it on other platforms before it gets taken down. Because I want to clear up some of this misinformation about the Bayside Mall incident that happened. Um, so me and my girl was in town and we were shopping at the mall and we noticed a lot of kids there. Um, it wasn't a real big deal at first until they got to arguing and shoving. Arguing and shoving. The same thing that the graffiti artist said. There's a little bit of commotion going on. And then, then like weapons got brought in and uh, they started fighting, running all over the mall, chaos just all over the place. So we thought we heard gunshots, but it turns out that that was actually fireworks. But either way, that caused everybody to start rushing for the doors. Uh, people was leaving stuff behind. I mean, just dragging their kids. It was just complete fucking chaos, man. Uh, anyway, so as we running, we look back and we noticed some weird shapes taller than me. I'm six foot two, shadowy, dark, solid shapes not human i promise you these is not human i mean it made the hair stand up on my skin uh and shit we just booked it for the door so again the shadowy shadowy figures but solid which is the same as um pippin that man i can't explain what that was i can't say that was aliens but i i can't say that sh that was not human it was not human and they online i don't know if they're trying to cover this stuff up but they saying that it was uh, police officers and, and somebody, not shadowy figures. It's 2024, man. It, it's something going on. It's something going on, and they're trying to cover it up. A lot of people saw what I saw, and like I say, it was so much chaos ensued that it was it was just hard to, 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 to let that sink in, that we was realizing what, what we're looking at. I mean, it's something... Something you can never even create in your head in a dream. Um, I'm putting this out there, though, man, because I want people to know that this this stuff is real. Get get this out and spread this. And if you were a person that was there and you saw what I saw, please put this video out because they're trying to cover this stuff up, man. They don't want us to, to tell the truth. And I got a good feeling this video will be taken down. So don't listen to the media. So um, <clears throat> there was another video as well about this kid that phones his dad that worked for the Miami police. And then, but when he, when he phoned his dad, he was recording from it from a, from somebody else was recording him phoning his dad, FaceTiming him. I can't, I couldn't find the video again. Um, in fact, I think somebody sent me on Twitter, actually. I, I could just walk you through it. Basically, his dad was saying, um, I can't talk about it. And and his son was like, "Really? You can't talk like not even anything." He's like, "Like how many how many times do you want me to tell you? In 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 how many ways? I can't I can't talk about it, which is weird, right? Couldn't you have just said, "Yeah, there's a group of kids with sticks," <laughs> you know? So then then there's this chick here, right? There's this chick here, 
Listen to this. Listen to her detail and how convincing she is, okay? I saw this, I don't know if it was six feet tall. I mean, uh, eight feet tall. It might've been like six, seven feet, six and a half, seven feet tall uh, person, I thought at the time. And they were just all dark. I just kind of glanced, cause you can see them cause they were kind of standing above the rest of the people. And uh, the creature was big like kind of heavy set with muscles or fat or I don't know but they were coming out of Lane Bryant so I ain't thinking nothing about it so I just kept on minding my business and then 30 seconds later like 30 seconds you can hear ah, somebody screaming so we looking around and then a bunch of people start screaming a bunch of people start um running and I, I didn't know what to do so you know part of me wanted to run but another part of me wanted to see what they were running from because uh <laughs> hey is it worth me running because i am not all the way in shape <laughs> and b what's going on so i went to go investigate and so i started walking the opposite direction i'm like move move telling people whoa what y'all doing what is going on are y'all crazy or something so needless to say but then i saw another one and this one was kind of short and wider and it had like a mask over its not a mask but like a, something over its head but looked like a shield or something over it and people were running and i'm trying to see like well wait a minute didn't they come through the front door wouldn't all this panic and pandemonium happen when they first came through the door how did they just pop out of nowhere what's going on i have all these questions going in my mind i'm a sagittarius so i think things so i'm like logically this got to be some people in costumes <laughs> but then i heard like a like a sound coming from the t the taller one and so i grabbed my grandbabies and we took the fuck off we took off running so by the time we got up at the mall the police were out there like get down get down get down and so we just kind of ducking like running like what, what, what you mean get down and next thing you know they started like firing over our heads so i turned around like what what the kind of find out that thing was right behind us and there were police like lined up and down the road. I didn't hear the helicopter that people were talking about, but it was hella police out there. <laughs> I, I you, uh, please believe. And but we couldn't get out of the parking lot because cars. Listen, were, like, listen to this bit. Listen to this. Like lined up, everybody trying to leave. So we ended up going to this um, restaurant across the street, uh, and you know, we were. So we went over there and ate and. I literally just made this whole story up. Everything I just said is a lie. But we did. Look, I watched the whole of that video and I was like, oh shit, yes, that's connecting to this and this connects to that and the dots. Are da -da 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 right? And it just, I wanted to show you it because it just goes to show how sometimes you can be sucked into something when you want to believe something, right? That's all I'm saying. I'm not saying this is fake. I'm not saying that the other ones are fake. I'm just saying that. It's very, she was very believable, very convincing, okay? So look, finally, we're at the video that I wanted to show you. And this is crazy. Not many people are talking about it. And uh, yeah, check this out. What is that? What is that? Let's hear it again. Let's see it again. It, it doesn't look, it doesn't look like, um, like reflection from a head, uh, sorry, a shadow from a helicopter or anything like that. That's weird. What I've seen. And not many people are talking about that one. Anyway, that's what I found out so far. But the biggest question of all is still, why that many police cars? Some people are saying it's a big commotion just to cover up a different story. Some people are saying it's legit aliens. Um, I don't know what it is. Tell me what you think. And also, please make sure that you see my top five tonight at 7 p.m. I put so much fucking time and effort into that thing, okay? And if it works well, I'm going to keep on going with the series, okay? Right, okay. Thank you so much. Love you. Take care. Bye-bye.